The advanced law trace track programs provide quick and easy access to information related to a bottle of wine at any point during the winemaking process. Additionally, advanced law trace track programs enable you to provide the information to the auditors in a timely manner upon request. Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how the advanced law trace track program works. Access the operation search for advanced law trace track program to search for and select the operation and vessel combination for trace track. You can search by operation number, vessel number and vessel class or by additive item and additive lot or by consumable item and consumable lot or by selecting find which displays all the operations. You can identify the starting point of trace track and then initiate the trace track by selecting trace back or track forward. This starts the batch program advanced lot trace track report in the background. You can filter the trace track data by specifying the number of days to trace track. Also, you can search by selecting base or configured operations code to trace track or by specifying the blend ID to trace track. If you want to generate a full trace track from bottling to vineyard, you can leave the number of days field blank. You can set the default values of number of days from the processing option. Navigate to the processing options for operation search for advanced law trace track program. In the default tab, specify the number of days. Additionally, the system uses the default values of number of days in by vessel, by additive and by consumable tabs. In the versions tab, specify the advanced law trace track repository version P31B370. You can also set the processing options for work with advanced law trace track repository. Specify the named calculation path to use when running the trace track application and the version of create edit operation detail version P31B87 to use to view selected operation. When you initiate the trace track process, the system builds the trace track data and saves it in the advanced law trace track header and detail tables. You can refresh to view the trace track status in the operation search for advanced lot trace track form. You can print the trace track results in a PDF format using the print trace track details action menu. The PDF displays trace track information by linking each line identifier record to its parent using the parent line identifier. The go to line identifier helps to identify the trace track of chains that we skipped to avoid traversing and writing the same dependable chain paths multiple times. The PDF prints trace track data along with key fields such as lot quantities, before after blend IDs, material types, wine status, additive item, lot numbers and the gain and loss information against each record. Click the available links or the view trace track details action menu to navigate back to the operation search. You can review the trace track data interactively in the advanced lot trace track detail form. By default, the system displays the data in single level mode. However, you can expand and review the desired record one at a time or use the multiple level option for smaller chains. The advanced lot trace detail shown here eliminates other vessels in an operation that are unrelated to the current trace such as other from vessels during a track forward or other two vessels during a trace back. It verifies vessel to vessel movements in an operation and removes vessels that do not contribute to the current trace track. You can select a specific record to drill down and use the generate trace track option here to generate a new trace track blend output for the selected record. Click the save trace or save track buttons to save the generated trace track data to the repository. You can also provide description and category codes before you save and close. Saving the trace marks the current trace track in the advanced lot trace track header and advanced lot trace track detail tables as saved data which then becomes available for viewing in the advanced lot trace track repository. You can also select a specific record to drill down and click the show trace button to preview the selected record alone in a multiple level format. Click the save trace track row action from the operation search for advanced lot trace track form to directly save the generated trace track data. The repository of saved trace track records can be accessed from the action menu or by clicking on the view repository link. You can edit the description and category codes in all the saved records by clicking the edit trace track header. You can also click the view trace track detail button which opens the trace track detail form again. Or click the print trace track detail to generate the PDF or click the delete trace track detail button to delete the saved record. To learn more about blend management, access the agribusiness page in learnjde.com. Thanks for watching.